Hi guys, so welcome back to the channel and thank you if you're new here don't forget to hit the subscribe button to keep in touch and get to hear when all the latest videos are out. So today I'm going to talk to you about my 35mm um, film camera collection. I started to look around for some film cameras and on the internet I came across West Yorkshire cameras and they had these really good um, starter cameras called Practicas. I think they were for about £30. And the first one they sent me was the LTL 3, if you can see that. So this was great. Um, it's made in West German, or sorry, the East German Democratic Republic. So um, as part of a Cold War era camera um, it came with a Miranda lens it, the, the camera came with this Miranda 50mm 1.8 lens as well which was great for the price the only thing that was wrong with this camera was the rewind um, button was broke so the the take up spool actually um, continuously spins no matter what so when you were advancing the film, it wasn't advancing equally. The further on into the roll you got, the wider apart each frame got, so you're only really getting about 24 frames out of a 36 frame roll. So I messaged the guys at West Yorkshire Camera and they were absolutely amazing and they immediately sent me out the camera that I'm using now, which is the TL3. It's the Practica TL3, it's essentially the exact same camera. Uh, it just doesn't have a self timer, which is unfortunate. Um, but it's great, the, you get full 36 frames out of it. It also, it also came with this leather holder as well. I just put a, a new strap on it and put my wee uh, Analog Wonderbox subscription badge on too. The lens I have on it at the minute is a Pentax um, Super Takumar um, 35mm 3.5, uh, also from West Yorkshire Cameras. The final camera that I have is one that my father-in-law um, told me he had uh, up in the attic. I wasn't sure what kind of camera it was, um, he said it might be a Zenit, so um, I had to say no, maybe it's a Zenit E, and yes it was in the the original leather holder as well with the same the original leather strap which is absolutely amazing like it's in great condition um so there we are and it has the 50 millimeter um industar lens as well which is 3.5 as you can see there and um, which is a, a is the like smallest lens, 50 millimeter lens I've ever seen. Um, it's absolutely fantastic. That's the, the size of it there, and if you compare that to the the Super Takumar lens, there's quite a big difference. When I first saw how well this camera looked. I was absolutely amazed. Um, the the wind on and everything worked great. Um, the, the light meter I believe is still working but I just find it a bit awkward to use. The one thing I did notice with this was that the the shutter on the, a speed of uh, 1 30th of a second or slower and um, the shutter would drag and get stuck. So I did some research on the internet and I found that all you had to do was tighten one of the screws on the bottom which um, adjust the tension of the shutter and that picks it right up and um, I'll add in a picture of what screw I'm talking about here now. And the other great thing about the Zenit E was that it has a self timer on it as well so I do have a camera now that works with a uh, self timer. Um, so I'll show you some pictures now and um, the black and white um, was a Berger Pankro 400 film which I ran through the Zenit E using both the 
in Dust Star Lands and also the Super Takumar Lands. I um, forgot to say, the Super Takumar Lands also came with this lovely little leather holder as well. Um, I have the Miranda Lands at the minute, but it's got this lovely green felt padding as well, which is a, a, a fin in fantastic condition as well. The colour photos there taken with uh, Lomography Metropolis 400. And um, both of those films are from the Analog Wonderland Wonderbox film subscription. So if you want to get yourself onto that film subscription, I'll leave the link in the description below for you. And thank you for watching, guys. And don't forget to hit the like button and comment and subscribe, please. Thanks for watching, guys.